folks, welcome to a behind the scenes look at CoolStuffInc.com. Now, most of you probably know them. They're the largest and best online retail store for board games, although they also do a lot of Magic the Gathering there too. But today I want to take a look at the Maitland location. This is the headquarters of CoolStuffInc.com, although there are actually four local game stores for Cool Stuff Inc. There's the one here in Maitland. There's also one in um, Winter Park, which is moving to another uh, location in the Orlando area. And then there's one in Hollywood, which is the one we play at, and then one in Jacksonville. Now, we like these stores because they are really nice to play games in. You can see they're well lit, lots of windows, um, lots of place to play games. Sure, most of the gaming, like most gaming stores, is Magic the Gathering or other card games and role-playing games. But these, each of the stores has board game nights, which we get excited about and we come to. And what we really enjoy is how the staff of each of the stores is really professional. They're really good to work with. Um, if they're not your typical comic book guy, you know, that you find at many of the different stores. Now, you'll notice here, just like many gaming stores, that they have a selection of Magic the Gathering cars and miniatures and, uh, you know, card supplies and dice. Dice are very important for everyone to buy, you know. But they also have a selection of board games. Now, they have a great selection of board games in the sense that there are very hot games. These are games that are, you know, if I was pointing someone and saying, hey, check out these games. These are the games that I would point them to. But you might wonder and say, well, that game selection doesn't look as much as, you know, some of the game stores I've been to. Well, yes, from a looks perspective, that may be true. It doesn't look like they have a ton of stuff, but that's because this is the Maitland store. And here you can simply go to their online website and you can order a game and they will go to the back in the warehouse and bring those games out to you which makes this technically the store that has the biggest selection that there is uh, it's, it's amazing and you can even do this at the other stores at the Jacksonville and the Hollywood stores and such you you can order the games it might take a couple days for them to come to you but it's essentially free shipping because they're just taking it from one store and going to the other store and it gives you a good selection their websites easy to navigate and find the games at but I like Maitland the best because you can just pick the game and then they will go back into that warehouse of wonder and bring the games out to you and that's why we're doing this video because we want to show you a bit behind the scenes here this is one of the rooms here at cool stuff that has all the magic cards in it and you can see there's just tons of magic cards in this room and inside this room there are people who their job is essentially just to sort magic cards out and that's what they do all day long there's other places aisles in the warehouse that simply are lots of different miniatures especially for hero clicks and miniatures like that where you can go through it's like a toy store in a sense because I go through and I look at all the different miniatures for these games it's a, there's you know it's, it's one thing to shop online it's another to go and just look at all the different miniatures that they have back here but their warehouse is a big warehouse and we want to talk here about the board games now what most people don't realize is that warehousing is a high expense for online game stores you know they need to be able to keep games in stock and you can't just have one of every game you need to have lots of these games in stock especially if a lot of people want it so you can't have every game you have to decide which games are worth keeping how many to have of those games that's there's someone at cool stuff that that is their job is to make sure that there's the right amount of board games that they have of the different types that people want to buy and so you can see here that some of the stacks that are bigger are stacks of games that are popular because those are the games that people are going to want to get. And so why the warehouse is full of other things like dice and miniatures and there's a lot of different things. There's a lot of board games here. They keep them uh, organized in alphabetical order. Here's the D's. You can see diamonds and dice down and there's Elysium that starts the E section. And you'll also notice as when we were recording here at Cool Stuff, You'll notice that there's big pallets of boxes too. Uh, when people make an order, folks will come in and they will pull all these games off the shelves and send them off to you guys. But to get to cool stuff, they're bringing in big pallets of boxes from distributors and from publishers. And these take up space in the warehouse too. They have to unpack these boxes and get these games onto the shelf and then take the games off the shelf and send them over to you. And there's just so many games that are constantly coming in and out. And look, a miracle, a wonderful thing here. You can see the FedEx truck leaving now. Maybe some of the packages on that truck are going to you. I don't know, 
But either way, this is one of the cool things here we like at Cool Stuff. This is the their big giant peanut machines that shoot peanuts into the box. Those things are huge and they're full of peanuts. And now why do they use peanuts? Well, folks, peanuts are the most inexpensive and yet best way to keep your games safe as they come to you. I'm not a big fan of peanuts flying all over the room either, but I'll tell you what, I'm a big fan of when the games come, then being undamaged of peanuts do the best job of doing that. You also notice there's all sorts of packing materials here in different boxes and things as these folks get these games ready to ship to you. And this is something that's in full process all day, each day of the week. So I thought you might enjoy a little bit of behind the scenes at CoolStuffInc.com. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Tom Vassell, and you've been watching The Dice Tower.